It's our top story tonight. The Lucas County Sheriff's Office is still looking for this man, Anthony Adams, a sex offender who violated his parole after deputies say they took him on a high speed chase or he took them on a high speed chase in Springfield Township Saturday. Michael Sandlin is on this story tonight. Michael, I hear this guy used some really dangerous speeds to get away. Tell us more about it. Yeah, that's right, Melissa. Adams was driving recklessly in a residential area. Deputies were worried if they kept pace, someone could have gotten seriously hurt or worse. So they backed off while keeping sight of the vehicle, and it was just enough time for Adams to slip away. According to the Lucas County Sheriff's Office, the chase started off with nothing more than a minor traffic violation. Deputies were patrolling the area near Chrissy and Hill Avenue when they attempted to pull over Adams, still not knowing that he had a warrant out for his arrest. Uh, the driver uh, didn't comply and the pursuit, the vehicle pursuit actually started. The sheriff's office says Adams tore away from the cruiser, speeding down Chrissy. The deputies followed close behind, running his plates and learning just who he is. All right, I got eyes. He's still on Chrissy North. But as Adams drove faster and faster through the neighborhoods, the deputies began to rethink their approach. The speeds became such that the deputies had to, had to back off a little bit because the way the driver was driving, uh, it posed a threat to the public. The deputies pulled back but kept Adams in sight, following him down Airport Highway. But Officer Lutke says in chases like these, every second counts. And that gap gave Adams just enough time to pull off onto Airport Highway, leaving his vehicle behind. Uh, they were out there for for some time, uh, you know, trying to trying to locate him, trying to find him. They searched the neighboring you know neighboring areas uh, in the neighborhood for him. But Adams had vanished. Captain Lutke says, while frustrating, there are sometimes factors that force the deputies to choose between safety and making another arrest. And in this instance, they made the right call. But now with Adams still on the run, Lutke says now it's just a matter of finding someone who knows where he is. He's entered somewhere back into his life. Somebody knows where he's at. Somebody's, somebody's helping him. Captain Lukey says residents near the area aren't in any imminent danger because Adams is probably hiding out with a friend and no longer in the neighborhood. But if you can help find him, call Crime Stoppers at 419-255-1111. You can remain anonymous. Reporting in studio, I'm Michael Sandlin for WTOL 11.